Uh, you've also been getting in touch on the phones. Uh, keep those calls coming in. Let's go to Hussein in Warwickshire. Hello again, Hussein. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm very well indeed. So, um, should the Met Chief be sacked? No, I, I don't think he should. To be honest with you, um, I watched um, the footage and just give me a few minutes this to is Gideon Falter, share, yeah. share my thoughts. Um, uh, Gideon was obviously um, opposed to the march yeah. and he, he doesn't support him. So the agenda is, seems like to provoke and antagonise the marchers. I mean, he's from London and so, so are you. I mean, you know, when you get onto the tube or you get off, there's a way of travelling up and down the escalators. You keep to the left. If people are coming down the escalators and you're going up on the right, that's obviously going to be breaching the peace in, in the tube because people are going to be obviously annoyed that why is he marching the opposite? Well, OK, the, OK, the by the way, direction. you stand on the right. I've, I've long gone battle with people on the tube about this. Uh, no, but hold a second. He was saying he wanted to cross the road. I've, I'm, I'm pretty sure he, he knew what he was doing. However, what is provocative? If, 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 if someone... I mean, I've been on marches. I was went on the, uh, the uh, you know, Solidarity with Jewish people you know, rally uh, a few months ago after this. Now, um, if on that march, and on a couple of occasions, I saw people I wanted to speak to, or you know, when we were leaving to go off you know, to get the, the, the train home, I had to sort of basically go you know, against the flow a bit and try and get across the road. That didn't cause any disruption at all. So why would a... Why would this man walking at a big long rally, why would that cause disruption if someone's in your way? You just walk round them. We, we, we manage it on busy streets all the time. OK, I, I've watched the footage. He wasn't just trying to cross the road. He was pushing police officers who were there to he police... He wasn't pushing the, the police. The police officer was, was stopping him moving. Footage. He was pushing and going through the police officer. They're police officers, they're the law. If he's pushing through... He wasn't breaking officers, the law. They, they were, he's pushing through... That's contact. He's invade, invading their personal space. You know that, and I know that. So let, let's be honest about what's going on. The, the right narrative is to respect the law. I've been on march. What, what law had he if broken? Are, if, if I said you respect the law, if they're policing the march, and I've been on marches, and if they've told us to go in a different direction, if we've been on the march and we want to head back the way we've come, and they said, no, you've got to be dispersed in that direction, we respect the law, we'd never, we'd, we never would disrespect them, no, I want to walk and go wherever I want. But that's different. When you're on, no, 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 like when you're on a protest march, when you're on an and I've been on, you know, on, a, on, on a couple, you, you, know, you, have to, you, you have to be directed by the stewards and by the police where to go, and that's part of the deal of being on the march. He wasn't on the march. The march doesn't. The march doesn't own that public street at that point. He wasn't. He wasn't. He wasn't even carrying a a, 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 a placard. Although I think he'd had every right to do so. Um, he just wanted to cross the road. Now, whether he was doing that to to highlight the fact that he wasn't able to do that, whether he thought that would provoke people, he's still entitled to do that in a free country. Well, the police officer was stopping him from going about his lawful business I... on a public street. He wasn't stopping him. If he was stopping him, he wouldn't have given him directions to say... He we was can stopping him. You. He's holding his You're hand up and not letting him You're pass. You're not listening. He offered to escort him, which is what members of parliament get. He got that service. He didn't want to level. be escorted by the police. He was be, what more could he ask for? Why he would he safe. need to be escorted be by the police if these were peaceful protesters? Because he was trying to breach... The breach? peaceful march. Yes, by... But what way was he breaching it? By walking well, into pushing it? Through, pushing through. He wasn't. Through. You've got How no evidence that he was going to push through. I'm sorry, you, you people, evidence, people in busy streets. Have you, have you ever gone You're to the Nottingham Carnival and things like that? People walk round open. each other. People manage to walk round each other perfectly easily every day, unless they've got an issue that. with someone being Jewish. He was being forceful. If you look at the footage, How he was dare being he? forceful. Do he you have any issue forceful. with the people shouting? Yes, I do. They shouldn't. That, that shouldn't be. That shouldn't be happening. Should they have been arrested? Pushing. He was. He. He was there at that time, and the officer was being polite with him and saying to, him, "We will escort you if you want to cross the road. We will escort you to help you." If that, I was in his position, I would have thanked them. So you're going to help me cross the road. Thank you very he much. He didn't want help crossing the road because he wanted to provoke a reaction. That's what he, he was there to even do. Even if he wanted to. If, even if what, you can done, only he, you can only provoke a reaction if you're, you're, the people on the, the other news. side are provoked by you. He's opposed to the marches. He's, What's wrong he with that? Like the marches. He's entitled to oppose the marches. He's he's entitled to oppose the marches, but he's not entitled to provoke them, to antagonize, to push no, through them. Is it? That's you cause, didn't. You have no evidence that he was going to push. 
him he, walking the through officer, the march wouldn't is not a is not an act it's not a criminal act he had every pushing right to police cross officers the pushing police officers you, the, you, you, he was you, being stopped from going about his lawful that. business. You're condoning that. Pushing police officers. Well, how, how come he wasn't arrested and how come the police, how come the police have apologised? Well, I, I think they were very tolerant of him in the situation. They're tolerant. And because, they were very yeah, tolerant, were tolerant of the people shouting you, scum and you Nazi had, at him, weren't you had, they? You had other officers saying he should have been arrested. So I think they were very tolerant and I think so they should be congratulated because uh, the marches have been gone uh, through peacefully. We've all gone through... Oh, have they been peaceful the apart there, from the people... Shouting Hamas slogans and calling for genocide of the Jewish state, and um, I mean, apart from apart from that, and uh, apart from the the, the horrific you know, anti-Semitism, it's been you, really peaceful. You 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 want to uh, basically uh, tarnish it with the brush of? of I don't know. Uh, I've made it very uh, clear, uh, saying I don't think yeah. that everyone on no, those yeah, marches yeah, like that, you, but you, the you, organisers you of the march are responsible. The the rule of law, you can't see him pushing to a male and a female police officer invading their space, making that contact. They yeah, were blocking his lawful path. They weren't blocking him. They were. They, they were literally were standing him. there saying, they you can't go. They were policing go. the march. We'll agree to disagree. Uh, they were policing the march. If you don't get that, I Just don't know Just want to check you with you, Hussein. When I go to a march on... The, the counter-march on Saturday, and I'm going to carry a placard, am I going to be in breach of the peace? Should I be arrested? Well, if somebody comes pushing towards your march and trying to go through and provoke you, antagonise you, then, uh, yeah, they, sh they, they should be uh, treated with the same uh, yeah. uh, rule of law that he's Never are, though, are they? Yeah. Never are. Jose, we have to leave it there. Really interesting to chat with you. Thank you for your call. Come